Hi, it's me, Cindy. This is going to be my last transmission for a while. I'm getting to the point where I'm on my phone too much, I'm on Facebook too much, and I'm not paying attention to anything else, so I have to do this. If there's anybody out there who has been watching and has enjoyed watching, listening to what I've been saying, I appreciate it. And to you people who haven't liked what I had to say, I'm sorry. This was just my way of venting. Okay, I have nobody to vent to, no friends. I can't vent to my parents. Because every time I try to vent, and it always seems to come back to haunt me. Or they'd manage to turn it around and make it my fault. So, I just can't do this anymore. I'm going to be giving my phone up. At least I think I am. I don't know. I really do need the phone, but. I keep going to Facebook, playing solitaire, playing games, and I gotta stop doing that. There's more to life than that. I just can't do it. I'm addicted. There, I said it. I'm addicted. I'm addicted to my phone. I'm addicted to TV. I'm addicted to my com to computers. I'm addicted. Face it, plain and simple, I'm addicted. I need help, but I don't know. But every time I try to get help, they tell me what to do. And it's not the right thing to do. Taking away my phone is not the right thing to do. Or any of that. Because then I just get pissed off. <sighs> Gee. My church. They have what's called recovery on Friday night. So I wonder if I should go to that. I mean what? I'm recovering from... I'm addicted to electronics. I mean, I know it's not like being addicted to drugs, but I'm still addicted to something. What do you, what do you people think? I'm out of my medication. Finally ran out of it, and now I'm starting to come. Ad now I'm starting to withdraw from it. I just need help. You know, on Friday, I have an interview on Friday. I won't go into it. I just have an interview on Friday at 8.30 in the morning. We'll see how that goes. I just can't do this anymore. I, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of this house. But where will I go? I've got no place to go, no job, no money. I never should have come here. I didn't want to come living with my, my, with them. I wanted to live on my own when I got back from Florida, but my mom talked me into, and she knows she talked me into this because she knows I wanted what I wanted to do. But then that was something else I've been called a liar about. She, they kept saying, no, you don't. You wanted to come back here. No, I didn't. I wanted to be on my own. I was 50 in my 50s. I was back in 2000. I wanted to be on my own. I wanted to come back here. And try being on my own, but I let them talk me into coming here, and that, and that was in 2011, and here it is, 2016, and I'm still living with them. I just wish I could get out. 
out of here. Go anywhere. Sometimes I wish. That I had never been born. I'm useless. I'm just fucking useless. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that. I just want out of here. I want to go anywhere. Just to get out of here. But I have no way, no way of going. I want to get on a bus, go to LA and disappear. I just want to friggin' disappear anywhere. Anywhere. I just want to disappear. Now, if there's anybody out there who feels the same way I do, let me know how I feel. <laughs> I'm not going to get my disability. I'm not. I mean, I haven't even heard from them yet. So I don't think I'm going to get it. I don't really want it. So we'll just see where that goes. I'm signing out for now. Maybe you'll hear from me again. Maybe you won't. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see. Until then. Bye.